There we go. go. Well, the temperature is around 14 degrees. The wind chill is below zero. And we're going to see if we can uh, get some water to heat it up with these fireballs. We're in the uh, White Mountain National Forest in New Hampshire and we could use a hot drink right now. <clears throat> Just put a couple of branches um, in this pit. Uh, something like what Jeep does in a Kano challenge and um, kind of just using this shovel as a heat deflector and windbreak. And we got the uh, Fargo wood burner that we've uh, got cranking here. Seeing if we can get uh, a cup to boil here. And we got two cups in the uh, Heine pot. Too far. The. Uh, the um, fireball is melting into the ice and it's a little farther away from the pot, even though I did um, put a couple of leaves underneath, but we probably really need a uh, small piece of um, aluminum tooling foil or something down there. Oh yeah, we've got some, got some steam and water, so. This is just too far away from the flame. Again, it's uh, around 14 degrees and the wind chill is below zero. And there is no issue with these fireballs burning. I mean, this is inside of a Vargo wood burner. And um, there's an insane amount of heat going on in there. All right, and if you can get the, uh, like in this uh, Vargo wood burner, you can get the heat contained in there. That's just one big giant fireball. It's incredible. Well, this one we're not going to get a boil. Um, the uh, got to get a way to get the. Uh, I mean, it's steaming up pretty good. It's a couple of close to a couple of hundred degrees, but um, you've got to get it in the right position. But definitely hot enough for a hot drink, which we're going to do right now. And we are in the White Mountains. So if you get that wax paper lit and you do have a lighter, you want to make sure once the wax paper lights that you've blown that flame onto the gel wax and it will ignite just like that. Otherwise you have to hold your lighter for quite a while. Um, so again, 
You take it, you're going to light it up. Drop that bad boy in there. And she's lit. There we go. to get away of getting that flame to hit the can just right. You can certainly start a fire with these. There's absolutely no issue. Doesn't matter what the conditions are. I don't care how cold it is, snowy, icy, or raining, you will get these uh, lit up and they're gonna go. You may not get a full boil, but you're going to come just, just short of it. All right, let's have some hot tea. I'm down for that. Cheers. Uh, man, it's beautiful around here, huh?